Imagine three million trucks piled high with garbage racing across our busy city roads. That is the amount of untreated waste urban India generates every day. This needs to change, not only at the city level, but also on a national scale. The Swachh Bharat mission, launched in 2014, paved the way towards revisiting India's waste management policies, bringing forth a paradigm shift in our thinking about municipal waste. I'm very happy to share that by now, we have traveled a long way. We have all our cities open defecation free. We have a large number of cities which are open defecation free plus or plus plus. That is a higher standard of not only taking care of the people do not defecate outside, but making sure that the toilets are very clean, hygienic, usable, and all the fecal sludge is taken out and treated in a safe manner. In this capacity building exercise, National Institute of Urban Affairs, which is an autonomous body under my ministry, has played a very, very important role. I'm happy to note that in the last four years, they have conducted 154 workshops across 58 locations in the country, where they have trained 6,160 officials, which is not only the municipal officials, but also municipal leaders. And it covers 3,221 urban local bodies. I'm very happy that this has been documented and they have focused on five R's that is refuse, reduce, reuse, repurpose and recycle how these practices have been followed at different places that has been documented and I think it's a very very valuable information and a resource which can be used by your cities. The National Institute of Urban Affairs and APEX think tank of the Ministry of Housing and Urban Affairs provided cutting-edge capacity building support through training, knowledge sharing, exposure visits and hand-holding efforts at municipal levels. The enabling environment created during these efforts clearly demonstrated that there is no better way to gain support and build consensus in the successful rollout of the government's flagship program and in this case, the Swachh Bharat Mission. When Prime Minister of India laid the vision of Swachh Bharat in 2014, and IUA started working with Ministry of Housing and Urban Affairs to roll out this mission and develop a lot of innovative mechanisms to build the capacities at the local level. NIU did a lot of cross-learning, peer-to-peer learning, and training through local language so as to equip the practitioners towards the contours of Swachh Bharat Mission. Solid waste management is one of the most important targets under the Sustainable Development Goals or SDGs 2015 to 2030. This reflects in SDGs 17 goals either explicitly or implicitly. The objectives of the capacity building program were a step in this direction. These trainings were designed to keep in view the needs of the participants. Hence, a variety of features were incorporated, which eventually led to the popularity of the program. The features included providing on-ground exposure, enabling cross-learning efforts, workshops designed for smaller cities and towns in Phase 4, capacity building for elected representatives, incorporation and use of sustainable and green products, focus on convergence, building an effective and easily replicable workshop model, plan consistently and use trainers for effective dissemination of knowledge. एक यूनिक तरह का वर्कशॉप है इसमें आप तीन दिन तक बिल्कुल जुड़े रहते हैं अपने कार्य से दूर रहते हैं और आपको पीयर टू पीयर लर्निंग एक दूसरे से बेस्ट प्रैक्टिसेस को शेयर करने में काफी मदद मिलता है the three-day workshop began with the orientation of urban local body officials regarding policies, practices and technologies for the effective management of solid waste, wastewater and fecal sludge septage management on the first day. 
The second day was exclusively reserved for field visits for the demonstration of centralized and decentralized waste management technologies. These sites were carefully chosen to highlight innovative and good practices being implemented across the nation for uptake by other ULBs of the cluster. The sites were chosen from 58 cities across India. The last day began with a recap of the learnings of the previous two days. This was done through group activities and a quiz to test how much knowledge the participants were able to assimilate during the course of training and field visits. One of the most pivotal sessions of the closing day focused on developing a financially viable and sustainable waste management plan for the ULBs. It concluded with a presentation by the participants on the business models they came up with, followed by a feedback and impact assessment. Based on the learnings of the workshop, an interactive platform has been created that includes details on the workshops, the site visit details, the participants, their feedback and the knowledge products that have been created as part of this project. And I want to take the learnings from this mission to the next level and we are looking forward uh, towards Swachh Bharat Mission 2.0 so as to build the capacities across the urban local bodies uh, towards clean and Swachh Bharat 2.0.